Police are searching for three people behind a string of smash and grabs over the last week. These thieves are going after cash and they have a pretty unique way of breaking in. Darius Johnson explains. A total of four businesses in one night, one in Andersonville, two in Edison Park and one just down the street in Norwood Park. This surveillance video shows the three Chicago police are searching for. The individuals hit four businesses the morning of July 19th and each of them they used a hammer to get inside. One of those businesses, Zia Social. Kind of a smash and grab situation, came in, um, three people uh, went up there, chucked our safe down, down the stairs, did some damage on the stairs, the floor, um, you know, did some damage to the safe, obviously, that was the plan. Took it out to our back alley, got it open, took everything in there, you know, and they were definitely here for money. Just blocks away, Moretti's was hit the same night in Edison Park Inn just down the block. The door remains boarded up. Crime has been out of control for a good eight years now, and we haven't had been able to put our thumb on it. You know, Police released this surveillance video from Edison Park Inn. You can see the three people getting out of a white Dodge Charger. One grabs a hammer to smash the glass in the front door, gaining entry, helping themselves to the cash register. Alderman Napolitano says these crimes are being committed in stolen vehicles and more police are needed. Meanwhile, these managers and owners are doing their own investigating to see if this could have been an inside job. Reporting in Edison Park, I'm Darius Johnson, CBS News, Chicago. Darius, thanks.